Yo, what is up YouTube? My name is Aaron and today we are playing Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. Honestly, one of my favorite games of Call of Duty in a very, very long time. And honestly, this is a great game to own a scuff on. So I'm playing on the PS4 right now, but let's get right into this video. So first, I'm going to tell you my scuff history. I have a scuff for the Xbox One. I got that a little over a year ago. And I have loved it. I haven't really got to play with it much. I haven't been playing the Xbox One too much, but I am going back to the Xbox One. I have tons and tons of videos for you guys, but today we're going to be talking about the scuff, like I said. And also, I got a scuff for the PS4, and this is the Infinity controller, which is, I think, the only controller, the only scuff controller you can have now for either Xbox One or PS4, unless you go on eBay and you find a very good deal on maybe a used scuff. So. First off, the price. I understand that a scuff is double the price of a normal controller and not limited to double, but over double the price. You could pay triple price for a brand new controller for a scuff, you know? It's something, something's happening there. And you might be wondering, wow, that's just twice the price for some paddles on the back? I'll pass. But honestly, it's not. I don't know what they do. I honestly think everything is new in a scuff it just feels so much better everything's a little bit more crispier and the sticks are amazing yeah i'm talking about the thumbsticks that's something people don't really talk about but they remain the same for a long time like i've said i've used the xbox one scuff for over a year and i've been playing zombies on it and zombies is the number one controller killer game i don't think i've seen another game like a zombies that really just goes through controllers and I can tell on that scuff for Xbox one you know just by the shell that it is a used controller that it has had some heavy gaming on it but whenever you feel the sticks and whenever you feel the triggers you just cannot tell it I mean if you closed your eyes you would think that that is a brand new controller and it is the same way on the PS4 scuff and honestly any scuff that you get that's one thing that is great about the scuff is that it doesn't really wear that hard you know it doesn't the sticks still get loose and it feels like you're running but you're not running they take extra precaution when it comes to building their controllers because honestly they're built to last and i know a lot of people might say like oh i've had a scuff and it broke it did this and yeah there's a lot of fragile pieces especially the paddles in the back of the controller but honestly if you handle the controller correctly if you're not just an animal and let it drop and fall all over the place although i have let my xbox one controller drop off of a stand-up desk many many times i'm not proud of that but it's happened and it's still here luckily but they're very good controllers um especially the scuff for the ps4 honestly that's what you needed from the get-go i really didn't like the ps3 controller i like the ps4 controller but now that i have a scuff for it it's made me love the ps4 controller and same thing for the xbox one it kind of just puts your fingers in a very natural state and it's it's a little bit more than just making you better at call of duty it also gets your hands you know more fingers to move less fatigue on those fingers but if you're in uh like a, a gray area of you don't know if you should get a scuff or not take it from me get it honestly if you can afford a scuff get a scuff i think it will change your game and you will really really enjoy the time that you have with that scuff so i hope you guys enjoy this video big old game on call of duty infinite warfare love it hopefully you guys are enjoying these videos i'm back baby